Hey, you. Do you see what you just did? I'm, I'm sorry, I just wanted to... No, there's nothing for you in here. The Paralympics shop is two blocks down. Amy. Very funny. Uh, I just wanted nope. to... Nope, we don't sell those. <clears throat> Jerry? Welcome to the store. I'm Sandra, the manager. <laughs> you know each other? Uh, Jerry is our new salesman. He has great recommendations. Best of the best. <laughs> I'm Troy. Top seller of the month, every month, and uh, new assistant manager. Uh, still in progress, actually. I haven't decided yet. Come on, it's just a formality. We will see. Jerry, let me fill you in. With pleasure. What a joke. Wheelchair boy selling sporting goods? Don't worry, he's no match for you. <laughs> sure. But it's better to be safe than sorry, you know? I'll assign him to the Department of Expensive Simulators. We sell four of them in a year. You'll never get ahead of me. My congratulations, Jerry. You did the impossible. Thank you. Uh, it's an honor for me. Now all our staff have someone to look up to. If you don't know how to cope, become like Jerry. Get to work, friends. Uh, that's all? Perhaps there's more news. Uh, maybe a race for me? Yes, Jerry. You are now a manager candidate. Congratulations. <laughs> Wow. Can I have a word with you? Yeah, yeah. I won't leave it like this. I'll get rid of the wheelie boy. But how? I have a plan. And you're gonna help me. Okay. I'm afraid no dumbbells will help you anymore, sir. How much does this model cost? More than you earn in a year. Sorry. May I suggest you an anti-cellulite cream? But please, try this. A sporting bra will support your sagging breast. Get out of here. Uh, are you in a size two? Yeah. I will complain to the manager now. Jerry, I don't know what happened to you, but you have some explaining to do. Well, what are you talking about, Sandra? You truly know what I mean. You have a lot of potential, but insulting customers? What? Insulting customers? I, I would never do anything uh, like I'm that. I'm a witness. And if I had the powers of a manager, that thing would never happen. Jerry, Jerry, you messed up bad. Not a good look. I hope you understand that this incident could cost you your job. Should I report him to the main office? Stop. It's a mistake, please. Let's see the security footage. Uh, enough of your games. No. Let's look at the security. Fine. Weird. Uh, this often happens. When the power surges, the cameras turn off. Yeah, but it doesn't matter because I was a witness. Yes, right. And following the protocol, I, as a witness, will report on this. I guess your little plan has failed. What? 
I bought this chain of stores a month ago and wanted to look at the kitchen from the inside. And it turned out that the seller of the month is willing to throw me under the bus and threaten the store's reputation to stay on top. How could you? Oh, please. It's obvious that you're working together. No, sir, if you just listen to me, I can assure you that... Enough. I'm, I'm not interested in your explanations. You gotta be the two worst employees of the whole chain. Trust me. If your motives are envy and cruelty, whatever you do, always end up poorly. Sitting in a wheelchair is my handicap, but yours is that you're just terrible people. You're fired.